Hey everyone, I wanted to talk today about the wilderness experience and no one can completely escape the wilderness experience. It's a journey we must all travel on. It's a journey that we must all undertake. So what is the wilderness experience? So the wilderness experience is often seen as a challenging period marked by this discomfort, trials, and tribulations, the joy of life are either hard to come by or absent, leaving one feeling devoid of encouragement is typically a time of heightened challenges where you might feel under attack emotionally, physically, mentally, or spiritually. You may face a spiritual, financial, or emotional drought feeling utterly depleted without any resources. This kind of experience is frequently associated with a mountain top experience. You've heard of that term, the term used in different platform before, the mountain top experience where you struggle um, to get to the top. But when you follow that path and you follow that that experience the outcome is usually a period of success or achievement so going up the mountain is hard but when you get to the top of the mountain you see the vision you see it clear clearly you see you experience that that success so a wilderness, a wilderness experience can manifest sometimes as, as depression a crisis of faith or multiple traumatic life events. The po- the possibilities are endless. It's not a joyful time, right? It's when you feel isolated, abandoned, and spiritually parched amid, amid a draining drought. This period of trial often follows right after a time of Accomplishment for some people, yes, for some people, it doesn't follow that pattern, but some people it does. So, finding an anchor is so essential to navigate through the darkness and the challenges that you're facing in the wilderness. For some of you listening to me, it might be your faith grounding you in the belief that there is purpose and hope beyond the present struggle. For others, it could be the support of loved ones, a reminder that they are not alone. For many, it's small, consistent practices that bring peace, like journaling, like meditation, or time spent in nature. Creativity can also be a refuge through heart, art, writing and music, allowing expression and healing when words fall short. Ultimately, your anchor in in the wilderness season is anything that offers comfort, strength, a reminder of your resilience, helping you to hold on until the storm passes. So what do you think your anchor might be? For me, 2019 was my wilderness experience and losing my daughter Maya really drained everything out of me. I lost my joy for living. What brought me solace was music. Music was my anchor. It became my therapy. Each melody, beat and lyric lifted my spirit and slowly I found my way back. Every day presented new struggles and challenges, but singing and listening to songs like I Will Never Be The Same Again, which was which is written by Hillsong. And I used to sing it repeatedly, uh, you know, I will never be the same again. I can never return. I've closed the door. I will walk the path. I'll run the race and I will never be the same again. This helped me to heal bit by bit. So today, what is your anchor in your wilderness experience?
take care.